Hey guys, Cajun Resell here, back at you with another plush sourcing video. Today I'm just going to go through my thoughts on buying plush, what I thought, what I paid for them, and overall what I got. Y'all seem to be liking them, so let's dig into this one. This little guy, I think was like a dollar, so I obviously wasn't going to pass this up. This is a new Attacks Build-A-Bear. Uh, I'm going to separate this one out and do the outfit separately. Both have new, new tags on them though, so this... I think it was like Marine Corps, maybe build a bear. I think it says it right there. Marine uniform, so twelve fifty originally. Then the build a bear says Reed Teddy. So these are two different types of build a bear. I will separate them out and sell the outfit separately and sell build bear by itself. But for a dollar, not going to pass that up. The two different thrift stores. I found this guy. <laughs> this is Flower from Bambi. It's almost. It's like the exact same figure. They both say Disney. Both say Disney. So, probably going to put these up as a twins lot and sell them. Uh, I hadn't found a flower in a long time, and all of a sudden I found two within like a week span. But, yeah, that's flower from Bambi. Found a little Minecraft. Uh, maybe a dog. I'm not exactly sure, but I think it's a dog. I think I paid like 50 cents for this. This one was cool. It's a feisty pet. If you don't know by now, feisty pets are cool. Some of them are worth it, some of them aren't. goes from looking so cute to being really fierce but it is a valentine's themed one i love you to death and i knew that the second i didn't need to look at this to see it because you can just tell the feisty pet the look the eyes the nose and then you just squeeze the back of their head and they look feisty it's a kitty cat though also found two little bunnies uh these are actually I paid a dollar for these two. These are like the Puffalump kind of animal. Uh, they're happy mates. I did look it up. They were both selling for... I'm selling these together probably. But they were selling for I think $20 to $25 each. So maybe put them up at 40 or $45. Bucks. Uh, they are pretty big but they won't be too bad to ship. Let's see. I went to a Goodwill. Got some $0.25 cent or $0.20 cent plush. I'm not sure which one exactly. This is Spongebob. Still has the tags. But I will be selling it as used because you can see those tags are pretty bent. But pretty good plushie. This is another TY product or tie. Stripes, the tiger. Beanie Boo. Also, uh, I can't remember if this was sugar. Yeah, sugar. Medium TY Beanie Boo. Picked this one up just because. I uh, thought it looked cool. It has the tags. It's... Beanbag Mates. I don't know if it's really worth anything, but it's like a Jamaica. I think that's Jamaica, isn't it? Maybe it's not. Bongo the Bear. Originally $6.95 from Hallmark. Another Beanie Boo. And this one's Le Leona. Yep, Leona. So I got a lot of Beanie Boos in that trip. Another one right here. This is Mist. Maybe, or no, it might be tricks. Haunts. I don't know them all. And then this little guy. Couldn't even see the tag. You can see it's really shimmery. It's like that sequin... Sequin texture. Even though it's almost like the same color. But this one, I will be able to look up pretty easily. I'll just type in pumpkin, sequin, beanie boo, and it'll pop up. So that was it for that bag. This little guy, I think, is figment. I'm not sure. It's a Disney uh, dragon. Disneyland, Walt Disney World. I think I paid 25 cents for him for these as well. This little guy. If you remember who he is, let me know down below in the comments. <laughs> I know he's Cartoon Network, and I did look him up whenever I... Uh, maybe Droopy? I don't know what his name is. He's from Cartoon Network. I looked him up, and he was worth it. But that was a while ago, so I don't remember anymore. <laughs> this little one I got just as a throw-in. It's a unicorn. Some people like unicorns, so I was looking for stuff to throw in at the last second. Because it's either pay 59 cents for one or pay five for a dollar, so you got to throw in some extra stuff to make make that five, even though it might not ever sell. This I got just because it was Victoria's Secret. It might be worth it, it might not be. And then I got another little pony right here. It's a purple My Little Pony. It's not a Build-A-Bear, it's just a pony. But for a dollar or 25 cents each, I'm not going to pass it up. See, I went to a couple garage sales and I got some plush for, uh, I think, 
I think I paid like 50 cents for these. This is Bambi. This is like a pouncing Simba. Looks like he's ready to pounce. He's going to get y'all. Simba. But some pretty good little plushies. And I got a little Sprite. I think that's what these are. Sprites. An orange Sprite from Hallmark, maybe. 1983 Hallmark. It does have a name on it. I might try to get that off. I might just leave it. I'm not sure exactly. I'll probably just leave it, actually. I don't, I don't feel like messing with that. Uh, let's see. The other garage that I went to was one that was like 7 a.m. in the morning. It was storming so bad here in uh, the Baton Rouge area, but I still went to the garage. To went to this. It was a church sale, really, but garage sale, church sale, close enough. All these I paid 25 cents for. I'll go over them in a second. But it's a bunch of little beanie boos. Some of them still have the tags. Okay, so first up is these three PJ Masks guys, or gals, I think Owlette's actually a gal. That one's Owlette, Catboy, and maybe Gecko, I don't remember exactly what their names are. But they're PJ Masks, sell them as a lot. Got this little kitty cat, his or her name was Cleo. Not really a beanie boo per se, but I still picked it up for 25 cents. This little guy is Mist. That's why I said that on the earlier one. Because I thought I picked up Mist. But uh, the other one was Haunts. This is Mist. He still has the tags. Looks to be in pretty good condition. I'll have to do a little bit more inspection to see if I can call him new or not. But either way, uh, he'll still sell pretty well. This guy. Got two of this guy. This one is Ghouli. So two Ghoulies. A little Chuck E. Cheese superhero <laughs> plush. This one's not as old as I thought it was. I think it's like 2012, 2014. And I got one little Paw Patrol. Collect these over time. I can I can find them every once in a while, Marshall. So I'll find keep him aside, and then I'll find like Chase and uh, some of the other ones and lot them together. You saw Donkey from Shrek. This is actually Shrek 4D. I don't know if I've ever seen Shrek 4D, but <laughs> I picked it up because it was Shrek. And then I got Yoshi as well. So a little Super Mario Yoshi plush. And I'll come back with some more. Also at the garage sale, slash church sale, I got this little guy, Donatello, from Ninja Turtles. Does have some tags. I don't think I even ever actually looked at the tags. Uh, well, it's 1989. Maybe this one's actually worth a decent amount. But I just saw it and I picked it up. For this one, I'd saw Ninja Turtles and didn't really care because <laughs> I know Ninja Turtles is going to have some value to it, especially at 25 cents. And that's what they gave it to me. They had small plush like at 25 cents, big plush at a dollar, but they said this one was small. I mean, that's a build bear right there. Right there. <laughs> I wouldn't call that one small, but hey, I'm not going to complain. This is a build bear This one I got for, I think, 25 cents because it's four for a dollar, and I think I paid a little bit extra for one more. So I paid like 59 cents for one of them, but my Little Pony Build-A-Bear. can't remember if this was a Build-A-Bear or not. I don't think it was. It's Trolls Dreamworks. I don't think it's specifically... That was a hard word to say. Specifically Build-A-Bear, but it's Trolls. This guy is going to need some washing and some help. <laughs> uh, typically, I don't wash him if I, there's not much, but you, if you can see, there's a lot of... Uh, he needs some washing, so... Yeah, he'll be washed before I sell him. Another Beanie Boo. This one's Glamour. So I'll put that one... Put a, put Glamour and Leona as like leopard slash cats together. This is Gilbert, I believe. Yep, Gilbert, the giraffe. So I got a couple giraffes I can lot up as well. One thrift store I went to, I got this guy. Paid like $1.99 for him. But comps are showing he was worth it. This is Simba from the live action uh, movie, I believe. Disney. Obviously Disney if it's Simba. But that one is easy because I could just scan it and look up the comps for it. One thrift store I found three little Dalmatian plushies. All from 101 Dalmatians. I think I actually this one's one that uh, wasn't didn't have the four for a dollar, so I think I paid like fifty nine cents for each of those. Alright, not gonna go through this whole bag, but went to one thrift store where I think I paid fifty cents each for these. 
This is the Kansas City Chiefs, a cheerleader, and the KC Wolf mascot. This video will come out before my What Sold video that comes out. So in this video, you're going to see these guys. But in the next video, I actually sold this pair for $40. So not bad when I've got all that in there. I probably have six or seven pairs of them in there. And uh, sold really fast at $39.99. So I'll probably raise the price a little bit and put it up at $42.99 and see if it sells or not. All right, I'll come back with the one bag that I'm going to open. This little guy I picked up. Out of this, this is the plush bag that I get for fifteen dollars. Picked him up because he's part of the I think he's part of the bowling pin set I've been getting. I've been get, collecting a couple of these as I go, so he'll be used later. Last, one of the last things I saw was this little girl. Uh, Y'all know what she, who she is, what she's from. Let me down know down below in the comments. This will be the test for today. There's the receipt. So who is she? And I already gave you a hint by saying she, but this is another one of the glimmer uh, sequin ones. It's Calypso, a Norwal uh, whale. Here's a little peep, a pink peep, peep, peep. A little plush peep. A llama from Fortnite. Threw it in at the last second just to add something to it. This little panda is Mione. I've heard that's a decent brand, but I don't think this is as good as I thought it was going to be. But... It's a little panda. Pandas can sell well. This is going to need some cleaning there, but it's a husky. Huskies seem to do pretty well. It's Aurora. Aurora is a hit or miss brand for me. Sometimes it does really well, sometimes it doesn't. It just depends. I got this because uh, these little cutie toes, or cute, cute tea toes, however you say that, uh, they're cute and they're small, so see if this guy's gonna make it out of the bag he did this is a goof goofballs i think obviously it's a frog it's musha belly chatter squeeze squeeze please for a musha belly chatter chatter i think if you yeah and then you can also squeeze his hand so I'd had that sitting there for a while, and this time I picked out a couple things I wanted, which are at the bottom of the bag, I think, and then I was starting to throw in stuff to fill the bag. So some of these top ones might not be the best picks ever, but this, I believe, is a uh, pick-me-pop. It's a little dog. This is one of the little Tsum Tsums. Uh, looks authentic to me, I think, but either way, it's a tiny one. Just throwing it in. Same with this lamb, threw it in. It's one of the beanie buddies. This little Chewbacca plush. Star Wars. Always, I always pick up Star Wars if it's uh, cheap. This is Max from Secret Life of Pets. This I got because it was LSU. No other reason. <laughs> I wouldn't pick it up if I were you, but it says LSU on it, so that's why I picked it up. This is a little Mickey... Uh, Dressed in a chick or chicken outfit. You know, one of the little Tsum Tsums that I saw. This little dog. Not sure if it's a... Uh, what do you call it? French ter French Bulldog or uh, Boston Terrier. Looks similar to both, but wasn't going to pass that one up. This little Jesus Loves Me plush. Uh, it's got the little Bible. It's got the barcode as well. I don't think that barcode worked. But picked that one up. This guy was actually going for something, surprisingly enough. <laughs> it's an XOXO. It's not that great of a brand. It's just Dan D. But for some reason, I looked it up because it, it looked unique to me. It's like a warthog with the XOXO on it. So that one might be one of the first ones to sell out of this bag. Of course, that depends on if I ever list it. It's a little koala slap bracelet. I found a couple of these. I need to find them. <laughs> but if I can list them together, I think that'd be something cool to sell. It's Wild Republic. A uh, little slap bracelet. This is another little cat, pink and white cat by Aurora. This is a cabbage patch dog, I think. Does have some uh, stains there, or maybe that's actually intended. It's on both sides. Maybe it's intended. But it's cabbage patch kids adoptimals. Does it actually have a name? 
Yeah, I don't know what that says. <laughs> but it's Cabbage Patch Dog, CPK. Sometimes the pets do pretty well, so pick that up. Pick this up just because I don't... It's unique, guys. Uh, I would have picked this up for a dollar. I would have picked this up for two dollars. I probably would have picked this up for even more. I don't know. I, I don't even remember if I actually... Well, I would have looked it up then, but I didn't even look this up. I just threw it in here. It's... Looks to me like it's Little Red Riding Hood and the uh, the wolf, Big Bad Wolf. At first I thought it was Wiley e. Coyote. I was like, oh, that looks like Wiley e. Coyote. That's what it looked like to me at first, but that doesn't look like Roadrunner. <laughs> so let me know what you think this is, because uh, from what I can tell, I think I have it right. Little Red Riding Hood. I don't know. <laughs> this is a, not a T.Y. Beanie Boo. I don't think. No, it was Wild Republic, but I got it because uh, it looked uh, like the look of it. What else do we got in here? We have this guy. don't remember why I picked this up. Yeah, couldn't tell you. But I picked it up, so it's in there. <laughs> no going back at this point. This little pony. It looked like some of the older ones I've gotten in the past. It did have part of the tag ripped off. You can, I think you can see that the, that part of it is ripped off. So I might have to do some more research on what exactly this is. But it looked looked good to me. And this is another Mione by Aurora Pink Flamingo. Might have to do some cleaning on that on its neck. And this little guy, Tundra. That might be the last one. Nope. We got one or two more in here. This these are some of the first things I saw. That's why there's the bottom of the bag. Another beanie boo. Bubbly, I think. Another tiger. Tigs. I've actually sold this one new with tags for decent money. That one's definitely not new with tags. Okay, and last but not least is this little mouse. I don't know, it's a little cute little mousey. Just picked it up because it was a mouse. So that's it for this haul of plush guys. I still got a lot more to list. You see a lot of these in the same pictures every time because I am a slow lister. I'll admit it, but I'm working my way through it. I like to list the new ones. Some of those have been sitting there for a long time and uh, I'll get to them eventually, hopefully. <laughs> but uh, thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to leave a like with your favorite one. Oh, yeah, we got to show you the little one, this little lady. And that's her name, Lady. This is Lady from Lady and the Tramp. I have a lot of her. I like her. She's pretty. <laughs> I might keep this one just so I don't, you know, I can sell the bigger ones I have and then keep the small one like her. We'll see what the value is, but yeah, that's Lady. So leave your, a like, comment with what your favorite plush was that I found. Uh, found a lot in this video. Uh, one bag, one big bag, and then some garage sales, thrift stores, a lot of stuff. Uh, don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed. Thanks for watching.